Hello everyone, I'm Elijah Page with LPT Realty, but you can call me Eli. Now in today's video, we're going to talk about Lake Nona and why it might be the perfect place for you to call home. Now, a lot of my clients, friends, and family love the area due to its live, work, play community concept, which their goal is to have everything you need in one specific area. Now, if you watch my St. Cloud video where I talked about the Sunbridge development, then you already have some knowledge about Lake Nona because it's built by the same builders with the same concept. But Lake Nona is much farther in terms of its development, which is reflected in the prices of the homes. Now, outside of cost, we'll also touch on location, things to do. One major issue that is rising across all of Central Florida that does also plague Lake Nona. If you want to find out what that is, stay tuned to the end. But before we get started in the video, please hit the like button, hit subscribe, and make sure to leave a comment about any other future video you'd like to see. Now let's get into it. Now the first topic we're going to touch on is the location. Now if you are a frequent flyer, you'll be happy to know that Lake Nona is only about 5-10 to 10 minutes away from the Orlando airport. If you do work and have to commute to downtown Orlando, or if you like the nightlife that downtown Orlando brings, then you're only 25 minutes away from downtown Orlando, which is great. Now you're also only 25 minutes away from UCF, so whether you have a current student or a future student, you're not that far to go visit them on campus. And I do recommend to at least visit one UCF Knights football game because the atmosphere is something else. Now you're also 25 minutes away from Universal and 25 minutes away from Disney. So if you want to go take a day trip to go to the parks with your family, it's not too far of a drive and you're not too close where you have to worry about the traffic. Now the next topic I'm going to touch on are the things to do. Now as I previously mentioned, Lake Nona is 25 minutes away from UCF, downtown Orlando, Universal, and Disney. If I were to talk about everything you could do in those areas, we'd be here for a few hours. So instead, I'm going to highlight what you can do inside of Lake Nona, one of which being Nona Adventure Park, which is a water inflatable park which all the kids love. They have climbing walls, rope courses, and wakeboarding. They also play live music every Friday and Saturday. And they also have a in-park restaurant, which I believe is Splash's Bar and Grill, and they have great chicken wraps. So if you wanna go enjoy the water, especially in Florida, as you know, it's very hot. That's definitely a great idea. And as I said, it's in Lake Nona, so you don't have to worry about driving too far to enjoy that like everything else. If you want to enjoy something in Lake Nona that's not water-based, you have Boxy Park, which has events every Thursday to Sunday. They post their events on their website, which would be linked here. It's great for watching big sporting games, enjoying live music, or trying one of the many very good food vendors that they have. Now, right across the street, you do have Lake Nona Town Center, which has even more great restaurants and my favorite wine store, Chalks. I am a Riesling lover myself. You also have the Courtyard Marriott Hotel and the New Wave Hotel, which has Haven Kitchen and Macan, which are also great restaurants restaurants in the area. Now if you want to get a parking spot on the first floor of the parking garage, you have to get to these events early. If not, there are always additional parking spots available. They are also building more parking garages to keep up with the rapid growth that's going throughout Lake Nona. And if you live in Lake Nona and don't want to drive, they also have automated shuttles that will pick you up from your home and bring you to Boxy Park or to the town center so you don't have to worry about driving. You can just enjoy your night. Now the second and last topic we're going to touch on is the traffic. Now Lake Nona is also home to Medical City, which contains various medical research facilities and state-of-the-art hospitals such as Nemours Children's Hospital and the VA Medical Center. So with that and everything that I previously stated, Lake Nona does have a lot of traffic, as does most of Central Florida, which is why the city of Orlando is currently working to widen Narcusi Road and work on future infrastructure plans. That way they can adapt to the rapid growth that not just Lake Nona Ball of Orlando is seeing, for any of my clients looking to avoid that, I've had clients relocate to Ocala, the land, or even to Polk County in areas such as Winter Haven or Haines City. That way, if you're working remote, you can avoid traffic if that's something that you don't want to deal with. Now, the last topic that we're going to touch on 
And arguably the most important topic is the cost. The median sales price in Lake Nona is currently $650,000, which is 9.6% up year over year compared to how it was last year with single family homes starting about the mid 500,000s, town homes starting about the mid 400,000s, and condos starting about the low 400,000s. Now the average days on market for a home currently is 46 days, whereas a year ago it was only six days. So there is a market shift and even though home prices are increasing due to everything that Lake Nona has to offer, the amount of time it's taking sellers to sell their homes has increased drastically. Now because of that, a lot of sellers are offering cash for either rate buy downs or to cover closing costs to help get their home sold faster. Thank you to you all for watching throughout the whole video. If you like, please make sure to hit the like button down below, hit subscribe, and make sure to leave a comment either about what you thought about Lake Nona or about a future area you'd like for me to cover. If you are looking to buy or sell a home in Central Florida, I'd love to be a real estate resource of choice. You can either text or call me directly at the number here. You can book a call with me through the Calendly link down below, or you can also view homes on your own on my website, which will also be linked down below. I look forward to seeing you guys next video.